I haven't done a video in a while, and I'm going to do a Q&A. I'm going to do a Q&A spe specifically talking because I've gotten like a question so many times, I think that I'm just going to go ahead and make this Q&A video a broad general answer to everyone who's ever asked me and hopefully find some way for people to be able to find this video easily in the future so that they can get their question and answer. Um, the question is, what video editing software do I recommend? That is a loaded question and I'll tell you why. My answer depends entirely on what you're trying to accomplish. That being said, if you want the best and finest in video editing software available on the market, in my opinion, whether you are on Macintosh or PC, it is the Avid Studio. The complete one. I'm like talking media composer. It's expensive. Um, seriously, if you're going for top end production values, if you're going for what Hollywood uses in like 90 plus percent of all movies made still, whether you're shooting in RED or on film or on a Panasonic HVX200 or a Z1 or whoever knows, really, Avid Media Composer is where it's at. Now, if you're on a Macintosh and you don't want to spend $2,500 on Avid Media Composer, you only have one other option, Final Cut Studio. So you're going to wait a lot while things render so that you can preview them because every time you make a change on the timeline, you wait. Unless you buy really expensive additional hardware. If you're on the PC, there's some really good news. Sony Vegas Pro. Live preview at any instant immediately after changes without ever waiting. It's kind of neat. Sometimes it down a resolution during the preview mode uh, so that the computer can keep up, but it's kind of a neat way to work. And honestly, if you haven't used Vegas, don't be attacking it. Give it an honest try. And then sit down with a cup of coffee, me and you, and we'll talk about it and really find out what you think after you've become versed in it. But I found most people attacking Vegas have no idea how to use it. Just a thought. Those are really the only editing packages I'm aware of. And if you want to know which one I use, I use Sony Vegas Pro. How can you beat 500 bucks? Now, I said these are the only ones I know about, and I said the only other option on a Mac was Final Cut. Well, there is Adobe Premiere, but since I don't consider that a viable option, that's just me though. I really hate the way Premiere works. Sorry Film Teller, I know you love it. In the end, I really want to stress, I really, 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 really want to stress that it doesn't matter what you use to cut a video. As long as you can maintain the quality that your eyes want to see, and as long as your viewers are happy, it doesn't matter if you cut your videos in Microsoft Movie Maker or in, what is it, uh, iMovie and Mac, I mean, it really doesn't matter. If you've got a good story or a good video and a good concept and a good design in your head, you can do it without having to spend a lot of money on really fancy software.